Hello and welcome to SDSC Specialist Cars. This is our video review of our 56 registered Mini Cooper S convertible. Uh, been really, really well looked after this car. Uh, really nice spec on her as well. Uh, we're going to have a look around the car, have a look at the general condition. Uh, finished in the uh, blue metallic as you can see. Starting on the front wing here, no marks or scratches on there, all really nice. And the front wheel there, again, really clean. Tiny little mark just on the edge, just there, you can just see that, uh, but very, very small. Coming along the driver's side, we've got the chrome pack on the car as well, so we've got the chrome uh, mirror covers there, handles and uh, rollover hoops. No dents, marks or scratches, the paintwork's lovely on this car, really nice. And the rear wheel there, absolutely perfect. Coming around the back of the car, we've got the uh, parking sensors on there. To get a new, we need to fit a new uh, rear number plate on that. Just uh, looks a bit uh, looks like it's been on there for a long time. Looks like the original one, a nice new shiny one. Uh, nice clean polished exhaust pipes, always a good sign. And the chrome hinge covers on there, you can see. Coming around the uh, rear quarter here, again, absolutely lovely. Rear wheel there, no marks or anything on that one. Paintwork on this car is unbelievable. It really does, it really looks like it's just been come out of the showroom. There's no sort of wear swirl marks or anything. I think the car's always obviously been garage kept. Actually, probably a good point because the interior was quite dusty. Uh, front wheel here, this is the one that always gets marked and it's really, really clean. One tiny little mark just there. So very, very good. Uh, coming around the front, uh, no stone chips or anything on the valance here. All really clean as you can see, really nice. And the bonnet, again the bonnet's really clean. It's a couple of little marks, but they've been touched in. Just a couple of little t t tiny chips just there. Um, but very, very small, and like I say, they've been done. Uh, inside we've got the full dark blue leather interior. Which I, I love this leather interior with the orange stitching. I think it just sets the car off, look at that. Nowhere on the bolster. Seat pads all lovely as well, really nice. Loads of kit on this car, as I said. We've got the cruise control on there. Look, I think it's got a telephone. I'm not sure, but it does look like it. Uh, automatic headlights, you can see there. The rev counter and the speedometer in front of you. All your temperature gauges and everything on the center console. CD player, climate control, traction control, six speed manual gearbox, heated bum warmers, and the silly button there for the um, tire inflator. Um, uh, tile deflation warning I hate those things because they always go off when you don't want them to center armrest as well another option that was on the car and also we've got you can see on there the Harman Kardon speaker system They're nice and clean lovely in the door shuts and everything Mini Cooper kick plates there and it's the same in the back of the car to be honest the back doesn't look like it's been sat in <laughs> it really doesn't it's got that matte sheen to the leather Driver's door card, all lovely and clean as well. Look at that. We'll open the uh, bonnet while we're here. And then we'll come round. The hood's lovely and clean as well. You can see part of it here, but uh, really nice and clean. No uh, mould on there, which is a, a common one on minis. And then in the passenger side, passenger seat, all lovely and clean. Again, doesn't really look like it's been sat in very much at all. Dashboard's all really nice. Passenger door cards all really clean as well. And we'll come around and have a look under the bonnet. And again, under here, absolutely lovely. Look at this. Really lovely car. Yeah, it's definitely been garaged because uh, even the nuts and bolts down here, it's cobweb there, um, uh, there's no rust or corrosion. Whereas normally they're all rusty. So this car's definitely been, uh, been garaged in its life, that's for sure. Close the bonnet down. There we go. And there we have it, that's our video review of our 56 registered Mini Cooper S. I think you'd be hard pressed to find a better one than this. It really lovely, lovely car. 
Should you have any more questions, please give me a call. My name is Stuart and our website is www.sdsc.co.uk. Many thanks for watching.